Okay, so uh, this is uh, in response to a question Jerry had on um, the uh, format of the uh, live drums that's located in user modeling. Um, I think he was having trouble playing it on his on his PC. Anyways, I just wanted to uh, I'll show you what what they are uh, and give you some uh, an introduction um, to them and how you can play them on your PC. So over here on the right, you'll see that I have my uh, Ketron uh, SD90. Uh, connected and uh, I'm going to go ahead into the user modeling folder and I'm going to go into live drums and uh, each of these are uh, the live drum uh, sections uh, that contain and I'll go into let's say this one here so this would be when you press when you have a live drum enabled for the uh, for the live drum kit that was uh, in the above named folder You'll see that here we have, you know, what's going to be played for a Ranger A, a Ranger B, a Ranger C, and so on. So if I uh, just want to play this on my PC, uh, in my case I'm using a Mac, I can have uh, the Mac actually open it and play it. So there you, uh, that's for a Ranger A, here's a Ranger B. Right, and this would be for a uh, fill. Okay, if I want to bring these into my my DAW, whether it's Cakewalk or in my case I'm using Logic, what I could do is I would just go ahead and take all these, select them, drag them in, and you'll see that here they are. So if I go ahead and solo the first one. could go ahead and here's the uh, here's a Ranger D here is a uh, let's do this fill here so that's the fill so uh, these are 16-bit uh, 44.1 uh, WAV files. They should be playable on any DAW. So if you're not able to open it, uh, you've got something not configured right on your, your PC, for example. Okay, and so what uh, essentially you can do is you can create your own uh, drums, in this case, uh, and put them in for the various arrangers, and, um, and then you can uh, assign that in the live drum section and uh, be able to uh, to play it. So that's uh, that sort of uh, just gets you started here. Um, maybe I'll do another video and I will actually record some of these just using my voice so that you can see how they work.